So somebody was arrested for asking a Republican politician a pithy question. This is a wild story. Local police are reportedly planning to charge a man who attended Senator Patrick Toomey's town hall after he asked the senator a question that was perceived as threatening. The exchange between Toomey and the man, reported by the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette, led Bethlehem, uh, Pennsylvania police to remove the man who law enforcement said they would charge with disrupting a public meeting and disorderly conduct. According to the Post-Gazette, Simon Radecki of Northampton County asked Toomey a question about a family member in an effort to talk about immigration. Quote, We've been here for a while. You probably haven't seen the news. Can you confirm whether or not your daughter Bridget has been kidnapped? Radecki asked the senator. After several seconds, Radecki then said, The reason I ask is because that's the reality of families that suffer deportation. Tim Fallon, the CEO of PBS 39, which aired last week's town hall, described the exchange to the newspaper as one of the scariest things that I have ever been a part of. No, you know what that's called? It's called holding a politician's feet to the fire and putting the shoe on the other foot. Because what the fuck do you think happens with, for example, the rescinding of DACA? What happens? People who've been here since they were fucking kids, many of them since they were toddlers, who know nothing else and nowhere else. You're ripping those families apart. What are you going to do? You're going to deport them? That's what you're going to do? People who've been here know nowhere else and have been here since they were toddlers, and 91% of them are employed, and less than 1% of them are criminals. You're just going to deport them. And so here's a guy who says, oh, hey, Mr. Republican politician who's anti-immigration, um, is it true that your daughter's been kidnapped? Because that's what's going to happen to a lot of these families under the immigration proposal of the president you support. Okay, that's called asking a tough question. That's called, uh, you know, striking fear into a politician to make them realize the consequences of their action. And he got fucking arrested for it. So all the people who love to say they're free speech warriors, specifically the ones on the right, where are you? Where are you? Defend this guy's right to free speech, because that's exactly what the fuck this is. This wasn't a direct threat of violence. This wasn't illegal. This wasn't disorderly conduct. These are bullshit trumped up charges. Pun intended with trumped up. Trumped up charges because they don't like how he triggered the snowflakes.